Great Heels Japanese Massage and Ayurvedic Body Work in Newark, Delaware. Okay. Newark, Delaware, where is that? Well, in the 1700s, we were from Noah's Ark. We're the Newark. That's how they got the name. Revolution started up here, and it's just a real interesting place to look at, to be. Okay. These are secret points, and what we're going to find, it's right on the spinous process on the spine. Okay, and you go to the inferior part of the shoulder blade and you take a little ruler and it's straight across and you go right to that spinous process and you just rub it. You just rub a little bit. Just rub it. And you won't find it in any books. Then you take this last rib and you just go to the body and just crease it, just find it, and you rub it. You rub it right here. You rub it. Okay. Asian medicine, when they start a massage, they start face down and they always work the spine first. If you don't work the spine, my teacher said it's a waste of time. When we did cadavers, that you take the cadaver apart, the horsetail of the spine, when we undid the spine, it was a 69 different threads. And that's why the Japanese want the spine worked. So these are little secret points, rub here. And I think this one here is called the Sea of Intelligence. This energy corresponds to the abdominal organs and the energy up here into the chest cavity, those organs. That's uh, a good balance for the energy. Sometimes in doing this, you'll feel that your hand gets very, very hot. And that's just energy. And that's what we like. We like that stuff to move. And I'm a Catholic school boy, and this is the biggest ruler I have. We don't have rulers in this house, because usually you always feel them. They whack you. They whack you on your fingers, they just, no mercy. They hit you with a closed fist. Girls, guys, they didn't care, they hit us all. Hope they get to be married someday. That's it from here. <laughs>